website there's like five scientists that answer your questions and you have to vote for which one you want to win and the winner gets 500 pounds to teach other kids about science. I'm a scientist is very much an interactive program for the students. They spend a lot of time on the website talking to scientists that are prepared to give up their time to talk to them and so it opens up their eyes a lot more into science. We've been looking like on their profiles and we also asked some questions like about what they do being a scientist. I was quite surprised at how technical some of the questions are and there were a couple of questions I was asked and I thought, oh goodness, I don't know how to kind of answer that one. I'm getting asked some very in-depth questions, I'm getting asked quite a lot of ethical questions, lots of things that get you really thinking. I would ask her if she ever came close to find out how DNA can lead to cancer. Then I get asked some quite bizarre ones. At McDonald's, is it true there's more calories in a salad than it is a quarter pounder? And then I get asked lots of funny ones like, what's your favourite flavour of crisps? or what's your favourite football team, and they're always good fun. It's really stimulating to have things looked at in a completely different way. Well, it's been really fun so far. It's really good to see so many students excited about the project. It's different to a normal science lesson because you can ask just what you want to ask, not what everyone else wants to know. The students can then comment on our answers and we can start to build up a sort of dialogue between the kids and the scientists. Sometimes we have chats and I think they're really good because we get to know it more and we know it's definitely them who are the scientists and they're actually talking to us. The chat rooms are quite manic because they throw in questions at all of us faster than we can answer them. But I've been really pleased with the kinds of questions we've been getting. It's that kind of the X Factor but on computers. This is more fun than the TV shows because we get to vote every single day. You get to interact because you get to chat to the scientists, be a part of what they're doing and vote for them. It gives them a say and it makes them feel like I've actually got a say here in who I think should have this money. The eviction's at three o'clock and I voted for Martin. I wanted Natalie to win but she got evicted and then I wanted Emily to win and they both got evicted. I don't know, I'm sort of split between Liv and Kirsten. I am. Townsend's just been evicted. Yeah! So start thinking about if you're going to be voting for Chris or for Martin. Well the students, as you saw this afternoon, they registered and logged on, no problem. I think one person find it difficult and that's because they haven't read the instructions. Most of them have been doing it at home in the evenings, either just checking if their questions have been answered or especially this week voting after the evictions. They've actually run away with it a lot more than I thought they would. I'm a scientist is a really good way of getting to loads of kids. For them to see, you know, that they can achieve anything. It doesn't matter whether they're from a certain background, a certain demographic, you know, it doesn't matter where you're from, you, you can get into science and you can be good at it.